Yeah, so SAR is a new program, stands for Student Air Rifle Program, and it started from the sheer number of students that were involved in the National Archery in the Schools program, NASP is the acronym, and NASP started in 2002 um, in Kentucky Fish and Wildlife, and their goal was to put archery inside the gymnasium in school. Uh, so they started training teachers um, to be archery instructors who then turned around and delivered archery curriculum inside the gymnasium to students. And to date, there's about 10 million kids that have been through the National Archery in the Schools program and growing. Um, on a national level, there's 47 states um, and, and a couple countries that are involved in NASP. So we looked at the, the interest that was there from archery and built off of that. We know that about 56% of the students that go through archery in school want to shoot something else. Um, this is my first year of air rifles. I've been shooting since I was like three or four. My dad had me doing prone before I could hold the gun. It, I was pretty nervous since it's my first time shooting in a actual competition practice. I did a lot better, but I think I did okay. So many kids actually in this group especially had never touched an air rifle before and so to see them just pick it up and be comfortable with it was just, it was a neat experience for them and for me to see them too. I thought it went pretty well. I did better than I do in practice, so that made me happy. It's a lot of fun, you know, and the more people that do it, the better it is. I mean, the most, most important thing about this program is that it instills in these kids uh, respect for the equipment and proper way of handling it, so if they ever do come upon something, they know what to do versus what not to do. They are extremely excited and nervous. Some of them couldn't form straight sentences. <laughs> You know, when I mentioned air rifles uh, that we were going to shoot in class, kids got really excited because they like, they like doing something where they can see it fly, like bowling, archery, it, it goes and it does something, you know? So they really enjoy it. I'm 39, I'm going to be 40 in April, and I had shop class in middle school, and we had, we had all the rip saws and the jigsaws and everything out there, you know? And I think for a while people were afraid of liability. Um, they were afraid if anyone was going to get hurt in their class, how that would affect the school. And I think people are kind of realizing when you take all of the risk away, a lot of the education gets lost as well. I've found the more things that you can get the kids outside, the more fun they have. A lot of times the bigger smiles that I see because they haven't caught a fish before or because uh, they haven't ever fired an air rifle before, but they learned how to do it and it's not as scary as they thought it was. I uh, grew up doing quite a, quite a bit of shooting myself and, and for me, it allowed me to find a sport that, that I was able to excel at and uh, we want to pass it on to other students too.